with the team playing so well, so confident, and already five points clear, is, is the biggest danger to your title hopes from within a uh, danger of complacency, of, of, of the, the danger of players believing that the title is, is destined to come here? And, and how do you guard against that as a, as a manager, if, if you see that developing? With me, that, that is not going to happen. We're going to lose games, of course. But the complaints and to be relaxed or believe what really we are not, that is not going to happen with me. Do, do you think it's impossible for you to go through a season un unbeaten then, like the great Arsenal team did then? You feel you are going to have games where you lose and you don't dominate? The only thing I, like a manager, I said since the, my career started is thinking the next one, and the next one is the Wolves. So about these kind of records, about these kind of situations, I know he likes a lot the statistics and compare what that guy he has done and comparing for the other one and the titles or something like that. So I'm happy for the 11 wins in a row because we show where we can win a lot of games in a row. That's all. To win uh, this kind, that is, is, believe me, it's no sense ridiculous because football today is so demanding. And we know exactly that... Uh, when we don't play good, we are going to lose the games. We, we are not what we are. We are losing games. It doesn't matter. We are not in the top five, top six, wherever. Any team can, can beat us. But only we can see in every single game, and Tuesday is another game, is try to be so serious and play good as possible to deserve the respect for our opponents. And deserve the respect for the opponents when they look at us, when they watch us on TV, on the field, and say, why, that team make a lot of good things. That is only I want. And after we will see when, when we arrive. But uh, uh, I'm here to win the next one and the next one and arrive in May at the end of the season say to how, how was the season, like last season was, and realize what we can do to get him better. That is the only thing. So, And pretty sure if you ask me now to finish unbeatable, that is not going to happen. Because we win a lot of games and a lot of uh, competitions today, so demanding more than ever, uh, and be focused every three days during during 10, 11. Always will be a moment we're going down. But I said yesterday, in that moment, I am curious, and I will test me myself like a manager and the players for themselves how we are going to react in that situation. Because uh, even Golden State Warriors sometimes lose a game, so everybody. Everybody lose game, and in, in, in we are and we are going. In, in our case, that is going to happen. Pep, it was only a few weeks ago that Edison had that, you know, the, the bad injury to his face. But he's he seems to have bounced back really well. How impressed have you been with how he's how he's done that? No, since the beginning, uh, I said many times, he's a guy who is so stable in the bad moments, in the during the game, and the good moments always is the same reaction. He tries a uh, good in the build up. Is good in the. Anticipating is strong in the in the in the line. So we are in 23, 24 years old. So we are so happy because for the next years we have a good goalkeeper for Manchester City. When we spoke to you about it, I think it was in Holland. You said that there might be, you know, troubles of him being brave, going for the ball. But today he, you know, he dove at the feet <coughs> of the striker. What does that say about his? A barley? Sorry, I didn't understand. The... What he he dived at the feet of the the striker today. So he's quite kind of courageous. D diving. Who, uh, our players or? Edison. Ah, bravery to go there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, so it means a lot. We normally, when this kind of situation, you can protect a little bit more and stay more on the on the box. But all the time he plays, like we play high, it is so important that our keeper play high as well. And uh, and that's why he he, he shows us uh, a lot with these kind of actions. Okay, cheers, guys. Thank you. Thank you.